It's our 6.5 presentation of employee service awards. And so with that, we will be presenting uh, and honoring our employees have, who have uh, served us for years. And uh, we are going to start off, uh, well, I'm going to give it to CEO Hutchinson and then uh, the respective department heads, of course. So I guess I'm kicking this off and it is my honor today to present an award to a very special employee of ours who I also know is somewhat shy in the spotlight, but Sarah Shukar, may I ask you to come up here to receive your tenure award? So Sarah is really an outstanding employee in our administrative office. and. She's a true example of someone who has grown and developed in her capacity here with the county, beginning in our office as an office assistant trainee and working her way up at where she presently serves as an accountant. And she is highly accurate, dedicated, uh, just a, a total breath of fresh air. So Sarah, we're so grateful to you that you have chosen Lake County as your employer of choice. Thank you so much. Thank you, Carol. Thank you. Okay, next up is Director Metcalf. Oh, this needs to be turned right side up. Uh, oh, sure. I haven't done this before. On the other side of the mic. Yep. <laughs> He's got it. He's got it. All right, it. I needed a script. <laughs> All right. <laughs> a rehearsal. They needed a rehearsal. Do you want me to whisper one? No, it's, it's okay. fine. Uh, <laughs> so we have two employees that are celebrating five years of service at Behavioral Health Services. Uh, Gina Hutchins, who is our Behavioral Health, um, what's her title? Behavioral Health Clinical Specialist. That's it. Congratulations, Gina. And Jolene Pryall, um, an office assistant also celebrating five years with Behavioral Health Services. And I think that was it. Next is probation, Rob Howe, Director, Chief Probation Officer. Is there a representative from, from probation here today? Okay, Pam, would you go ahead and give those awards for the Probation office? Yes. One award? We have Nicholas Yamamoto celebrating five years and Jeremy Pickens celebrating 10 years. <laughs> Next, we have public health. Is there a representative from Public Health Administration here today in Zoom or in person? Okay. We have Jennifer Thorpe celebrating five years. Okay. Next up, we have Public Services, Director Lars Ewing. Thanks, Dan. <laughs> All right, so uh, Kelly Gray is, uh, Kelly, come on up. 20 years, and it's actually 21 now, we're celebrating it. Um, so Kelly is an absolute workhorse around here, not just here in the courthouse, but every, every county building, inside and out. I don't think you can go to any building and, and not see his, uh, his handiwork. So uh, he would much rather be out there doing that work than being up here. So I'll cut it short, but Kelly, uh, thank you very much for your work and looking forward to more. All right.
Thanks. Next up is the, <laughs> next up is the register of voters. So I'd like to introduce the five-year award to uh, Lourdes Pantaleon, my deputy registrar of voters. <laughs> Next up, we have the sheriff's department. Good morning, Captain Joukowsky, Captain Taylor. I'm the patrol commander. Captain Taylor is the jail commander. I'm going to read the names of our uh, patrol deputies, and then Captain Taylor is going to read the names of the uh, correctional deputies. So we got <clears throat> Jose Martinez, newly promoted sergeant at 10 years. <clears throat> Have Gary Frace at 15 years. Richard Kreiser, who can I be here? He's at 15 years. Oh, you are here. Get on up, Richard. <laughs> you, you can stand with the group now that you're retired. <laughs> and Norm. Good morning. Um, so here to recognize the uh, deputies and staff that work within the jail facility. Um, 15 years worth of service, Deputy Matthew Gibson. And although he couldn't be here, William Tinkler with 25 years of service. We'd also like to recognize uh, two other staff members with five years of service each, Rebecca Moore and Christina Tai. Next up, we have social services. Gift. Yeah, everybody got one. Good morning, Crystal Markitan. I'm the director for social services, and I'm happy to present the following awards. Um, first, we have Veronica Garcia, eligibility specialist supervisor, five years. Heather Kriken, Social Worker Supervisor, CPI Child Welfare, five years. Joy Long, Social Worker for Child Welfare, five years. Brian Parsons, Information System Analyst, two, five years. Andrea Ramirez, Eligibility Specialist, two, five years. 
uh, Eunice Rivera, Eligibility Specialist 2, five years. <laughs> Caitlin Sliger, Eligibility Specialist 3, five years. <laughs> Christina Thomas, Social Worker 1, five years. <laughs> Mark Valle, Social Worker 3, Child Welfare, five years. Betsy Wetmore, Staff Services Analyst 2, five years. <laughs> David Rogers, Social Worker 3, 10 years. <laughs> Melinda Bourgeois, Program Manager, 15 years. <laughs> Stacy Soddy, Staff Services Analyst 2, 15 years. Jenny Billings, Public Authority Specialist, 15 years. Barbara Dwyer, Eligibility Specialist Supervisor, 20 years. And Betty Kukowitz, Employment and Training Worker, 2, 20 years. We have special districts. Good morning, everyone. Uh, Scott Harder is not able was not able to be here today, so I will be reading his kind words for our employees. So first off, we have Lori Baca. Uh, Lori is the heart and soul of the special districts administration department. She is the glue that holds all of us together. She's our customer service coordinator. If you have a question for special districts, Lori most likely has the answer. Lori always has a positive attitude and a smile on her face, and it rubs off on the rest of the staff. She's also a very talented artist. I know that I can speak for everyone at special districts when I say, Lori, we appreciate you, and you'd be nearly impossible to replace. Thank you for five years of service. Yeah. Second, we have Eric Luna. Eric was one of our water and wastewater treatment plant operators down in Southeast. Eric always has an upbeat, Eric is always upbeat and brings a positive can-do attitude to each workday. He shows up early each day to tackle whatever jobs or tasks that he's assigned. He is always encouraging to other staff and his small efforts have a huge positive impact on the department. We're fortunate to have Eric in our department and I want to congratulate him on five years of service. Thank you. And next we have Public Works. Yeah, I didn't bring my glasses. <laughs> Is that big enough? That's perfect, thank you. <laughs> Good morning, Scott DeLeon, Public Works Water Resources Director. Uh, my employee uh, dislikes being here even more than yours. So he's uh, on an excavator somewhere and for 15 years of service, like to recognize Jose Gutierrez. And just a few more five-year awards, if you'll bear with me a little bit longer. I neglected to mention that Matthew Rothstein, Deputy CAO in the Administrative Office, are also our PIO and our faithful Zoom pilot. Uh, as we speak at this moment, Matthew Rothstein, five-year award. Thank you, Matthew. <laughs> and where would we be if we didn't also recognize the incredible leadership sitting up here on the dais? Today it is my honor to show my appreciation to Supervisor Simon for his five years of service. And also to Supervisor Scott. Thank you so much for a wonderful five years of service.
So last but not least, we have a group of very lucky department heads, lucky because they're about to be recognized in ways they would prefer uh, probably to remain anonymous, but nonetheless, here we go. And so uh, we have a group of five department heads that are going to be recognized, and the uh, three out of five of them illustrate that Lake County must be a pretty good place to work because three out of five of them uh, came to Lake County for work, left for a short time, and came back, just couldn't stay away, and uh, are now are spending the rest of their careers with us, hopefully. And so I'll start with our first 10-year award recipient, Director Metcalf. Can you come on up? Thank you, Todd. Um, we're just so pleased. Uh, let me tell you a little bit about Todd. He actually, <laughs> he actually worked for the county all the way back in 2003. He was the office manager for our old visitor information center over on the North Shore. Um, he left county employment and later returned in 2012 when actually I hired him to be the program manager uh, of adult services at the Department of Social Services. In 2016, Director Metcalf was promoted to the Director of Behavioral Health, where he continues to serve today. Todd, congratulations on your 10-year anniversary. I have, to, I have to do something? No, uh, no thank you, Carol. Um, I thank you for, for bringing me back to Lake County um, and had a great time with social services and um, having a lot of fun at Behavior Health Services as well. So thank you. Thank you. We'll see if we can do it another 10 years. Great. PJ has your award. I'll try. Do we have to do a photo? <laughs> Thank you. Thank Thanks, you, and, and I just want to take a moment and compliment HR on the great photos that, that you did today. The background for these photos, um, they just really pop. So nicely done. So next up is a 15-year award recipient, and it goes to IT Director Shane French. He began his career with the county here in 2006. He was an IT tech. He moved his way up the career ladder very quickly, promoting to Deputy IT Director in 2008 and on to IT Director in 2010, where he now leads us in terms of our technological support and enhancements. Our world of technology has come so far in these years, thanks to Shane's dedicated leadership. Shane, I don't see you in the room, perhaps you're with us in Zoom, but I want to thank you for your incredible service to these past 15 years. <laughs> Wonderful picture of Shane and his family. Next up, another 15-year award recipient goes to our special districts administrator, Scott Harder, who we were advised a few minutes ago is, is not with us today. He's another department head that left us at one point, but just couldn't stay away. He actually started his career with the county way back in 1996 as a building grading inspector, promoting to assistant engineer in 1999 and on to associate civil engineer in 2003. He left us in 2004, returning a decade later to serve as deputy special districts administrator. In 2020, our board promoted him to the top position at special districts where he now serves as Special Districts Administrator. We're so grateful to be Scott's employer of choice. Thanks for the 15 years and more. Our next award goes to our Sheriff Coroner OES Director, Brian Martin, who I believe is uh, not available today. Uh, but Brian also has a great history with the county where he left and came back, which is a wonderful thing for us. He first began with Lake County as a deputy sheriff in 2005, but he was on an obvious career path, promoting to sergeant in 2007. He left us in 2008, only to return a year later, continuing his career path as sergeant. In 2010, Brian Martin promoted to lieutenant, but again left county employment in 2011, but not for very long. Returning in 2012, he served as our assistant chief probation officer. 
He ran for sheriff, was elected, and began his career as our chief law enforcement officer, where he continues to serve in this capacity today. Sheriff Martin, what a great ride. Thanks for the 15 years and more. <laughs> Ms. Grant, would you do me the honor of coming over here? <laughs> <laughs> she loves this, as you can tell. So, um, and last but certainly not least, a very special 30 year years of service award to our Lake County Council, Ms. Anita Grant. Anita has served her entire career in the County Council's office beginning as Deputy County Council One, promoting all the way up the career ladder to County Council, where she assumed leadership of the office in 2005. We are so fortunate Ms. Grant has made her career here in Lake County. Her support <laughs> and service is invaluable. Thanks from all of us for your incredible 30 years. Thank you. Well, thank you to all of our hardworking employees. We appreciate your service to Lake a real County. Nice picture. Yes. <laughs>